the Spider 4 Pro is basically a calibration tool that lets you calibrate the colors, contrast, and brightness of your monitor to specifically fit your needs. So this is mainly for graphic designers or people who want to get an accurate color reading of their monitor. Now I have a an ASUS uh, monitor that's a fairly decent one. It's an LED backlit one. It's all the other fancies with fan, got all the other fancy fancy features with it. And with the Spider Pro, it allows me to string this little thing down, and with a piece of software, this is able to read by way of a little camera and some other special stuff there. It's able to read what kind of monitor I have and what this color should be and what that color should be, etc. So I'll just cut to a clip that show that's showing you like that part of the procedure. And then, yeah, it, it basically, it really does make a difference. This is after I've already calibrated it, so it's all good, and it does make it, it made a little bit of a difference, but most of the time, nowadays, things are going to be exact. But if you want that direct level of uh, satisfaction that you know that this color is this color and everything is correct, I would greatly uh, advise you to get one of these. Alright, so the Spider Pro now is just measuring the all the colors of my monitor after I've set everything up. And right now it's on a kind of a greenish kind of tinge and it just goes through like reds, blacks, whites and everything and it's been about three and a half minutes now that it's been doing this. And I do have every window in my room kind of um, blocked off, so if you do that or you do this at night with no other light, I really should have this other monitor off, really. Let's just turn it off. So there's no light coming in and affecting that uh, area that the Spider Pro is sitting on. So, yeah. While I'm here, while that's doing that, I'll just show you this little dock that it comes in. Nothing too special. Just has a little mounting screw. And then the Spider Pro sits there like that. So now it's back onto a, a black, a bluish, navy bluish kind of tinge. And after this finishes, I'll come right back to you. So in conclusion, my opinion of the Spider Pro is this. If you're a graphic designer and you want the best color accuracy and the best contrast and brightness levels, etc. for your screen, I would recommend getting the Spider Pro. Although, if you're just wanting to play a game or do some video editing here and there and you think the colors are pretty well uh, correct on your monitor, then I wouldn't necessarily recommend it to you. I have this because my I'm a photo I edit photos with lots of video and things like that, but really it didn't make a huge difference. But on other, on other screens, such as the IMAX glossy screen, it really does make a bit of an impact to what the color ratio is. On the MacBooks, though, they happen to have some of the best color cal calibration ever that anyone has seen on a monitor. So that is where I would recommend it for. I would recommend it for just older LCD monitors, ones that aren't fully up to date with the latest and greatest of Adobe suites and the best color ratios and things like that. So I thank you for watching, if you enjoyed this video, please hit that subscribe button and click that like button.